Nganiet galungu mulefa kamu sendeni. Now in your quest, in your obsession, these people they are obsessed with the Edga Chagwalungu. Hmm? In all your obsession with the Edga Chagwalungu, mwamba na kula chite ni pamba numba. Mi pamba eh? Ukuya tantika fima 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 mnyoto kafya nkondo pama pamanda yama 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 foleni freedom fighters vachab. Just because you don't want Lungu to go there. Ni Zambia yenu. Ah, we ba musamba tefe ba chita. Na bobe ni yaba le nipera ma instructions. Kube kari kapansi mwaba funda. Some people you need to educate them. Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. I know guys, to the mood drama. We are in full dictatorship. The drama continues. We saw the police there at Embassy Park, you know, uh, and they made a statement that they were under instructions to arrest everybody who went there. So, we, you know, it's just depressing, you know. Love you too, love you too, Bachanda Mulishani. Awena Fuwe in the view view. We see you by Alex Mulishani. Comments below. Where is JJ Banda? Indeed, where is JJ Banda? Comments below. This is Queen Pumi here. I'm your human rights advocate. We are here to talk about the injustice which is happening in Zambia. Too much injustice. Yes. I'm in the kitchen today. I won't be here long, but you know. The country is Pamwandini. The country has gone to the dogs, for lack of a better word. <laughs> for lack of a better word. Our Peter to the Wino, the Sale Para. We are here to fight for the justice of Zambia. We shall not sit back and uh, and wait and and uh, just uh, look and watch the country be taken to a dictatorship in 2024. You know the behavior of Zambia police leaves much to be desired. You know, share the video, share with somebody. Me, I'm a human rights advocate. I'm also a, a leader of New Era Democratic Party. And for those of you who know me, you know that I've been uh, on social media platform advocating for justice and equality for all. And, uh, you know, we advocated for UPND to come to power on a promise to fix things. But apparently by UPND came to power to revenge. The UPND came to power to revenge, you know? And I'm, I'm gonna mention uh, Matomola Likwanya because he's my son. I campaigned with Matomola Likwanya and he posted something on his page today and it was posted in one of the WhatsApp groups and I was really disturbed and uh, I'm actually disappointed. I know he wrote something to say he respects me. I respect you too. I respect you, Matomola, and, and I don't expect any youth to engage in politics of hatred. You know, when is it gonna? When is it going to end? If 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 the youths of today, like Matomola Dikwanya, start engaging in uh, politics of hatred, tit for tat, Matomola writing on his page that is going to be like this until 2031. That is planting a seed of hatred. We don't want that. Personally, I don't want that. That is hate speech. And if somebody said that from the opposition, right now they will be arrested. You know, Matomola is getting away to preaching hate speech because it's UPND. And I'm talking about this because this is the, it's become the norm. It's become the norm for praising us to preach hate speech and get away with it. But let somebody who is not UPND 
preach hate speech. He won't sleep in the house. He will be charged with hate speech right away. We saw today where uh, Honorable Munia Zulu was, was, was charged without even the people who accused him appearing him in court. You know? Like how far is UPND going to take this country in a quest to get their revenge? Because they didn't campaign on a revenge ticket. If myself I knew that UPND, their plan was to, to do revenge, I would not have campaigned for them. And many other people who gave their vote, they are, many people voted for UPND, even if they are UPND, because we wanted change. We didn't want the same nonsense to continue in, in, in UPND. Now we are seeing the exact same nonsense and the praise singers actually praising to say this happened to uh, to us so much more but i'm saying we are here to say zambia now the population of zambia is 21 million we have 21 million zambians now out of those 21 million zambians only 1.8 voted for pf so each other chance it should be the moment waba 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 pfu should the whole country suffer the whole country of zambia should they suffer because of this beef between upnd and pif and 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 the pf yeah a question to you by upnd and the president haka inde ichilema should you drag this country into the into uh, into the dark ages because of your beef with the pf mind you imaba upnd and the pf you are less than 20 uh, percent of the population zambia is able to get up it's over 21 million the projected population of zambia is over 21 million but avan to tre chudira mo to achudira mo icharo cha chudira mo mulandu wa pf who are only 1.8 na imeba upnd who voted for you they were only 2.8 so number a whole country out of 21 million people because of 1.8 and 2.8 total is 4.6 million People each are not children. To children, they more in my UPND. Hello, my children, my children, no more fee. My UPND, my children, no more fee. And you come and fix things. You come and fix things. My foot. Hello, now I'm present. Paka na ba chief, I'm present. I'm alanda. Info, I'm paka ya alanda. Na mumu na paka ba I'm present. I'm alanda. Tawe. Promise after promise. Eh? chief balanda the chief had to speak and kudos to you by chief mpezen na kunkula kudos to you by chief mpezen and all chiefs should follow suit and condemn this government they will not trouble 21 million people they will not trouble 21 million people because of their beef with pf Me, I am here to say, in the name of Jesus, we say no. Because of your beef, Naba PF. You come and fix things, but you are worse. You are worse than PF. Every day to have book a parading like a pokola, nefima tankers, as if we are at war. What kind of nonsense is this? Was Zambia police? Bam Samba, you should resign right away. Bam Samba should resign. We can't be living in a country. Kwatu to the Kurikuyu Karen. Have you declared war against the Zambians? Do you need ama army tankers mumu seba for one person for eight gala chagwarungu? Do you need to parade the baka pokola? Ten thousand every time we wake up full baka pokola. When we wake up, we look at the newspapers. Ni baka pokola pamusebo. 
Eh? Is Zambia at war? Oh, it's a shame, really. It is really the shame. It is a shame. Chita in share. Much take share. Ba Musamba should resign. Zambia is not at war. If it's Ed Galungu you want, remove Ed Galungu's immunity and try him in the court of law. Not if you have a Ba Ed Galungu bakane no kwenda. Ba PF bakane no kukula chita practice some activities yawo. Muna nduanshi. These are crimes against humanity. I'm just saying, me, I'm a human rights activist. People like Musamba will be tried for crimes against humanity when the time comes. I'm just stating a fact here. Because if it is my oppression, this thing of oppression, of oppressing human beings is a big deal. It's not a simple issue. The thing of oppressing human beings is not a simple issue. It's a big issue. But Ed Galungu is not a prisoner. PF are not prisoners. They have a right to assemble anywhere they want. They have a right. Zambians, we are peaceful people. Zambians, we are peaceful people. Ed Gachagwalungu has a right to assemble anywhere he wants. PF, as Zambian citizens, they have a right to assemble anywhere they want. No mbaimwe wa msamba. Awa le mipera ma instructions ukwe wati. Mure kanya abantu kwenda. Abantu nga mwafati abantu bala ya kuri yoko mwayata ntika waka pokola. Eh? Women are being raped, you don't do anything. Abantu bala ya baby da mumu sebo, you don't do anything. The mandate is to protect citizens. Is your, has your mandate now changed to just following a oppressing opposition? Your mandate yaba zambe polisi ya dichinja kula 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 konka lungu wako ya konse. No, 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 no. We say no to this. Ba musamba, just resign. Because imina ndushkesa pamu tuwewe nu ba musamba, crimes against humanity. Ba IG. Imina ndushkesa pamu tuwewe nu. Techimule kanya wa ntu kuenda. Kuemba si paki kuria. Anyone can go and lay a wreath up a wreath wider. Tamkwe tensa ambu imu ya kulesho munturi onse. Ukuya ku embassy park. Mukubika amaruba or to pay his memorial to anyone at any time. You have no right. Ero ba haka inde techibale kanya abantu. Ngani ba haka inde bale pera my instructions. Ba haka inde techibale pera abantu ati. Takuli uwa ala yako ku embassy paki. Because inena ala yako. Ah ah. So embassy paki na ya luke ya ba haka inde ichile. Mani private property ya ba UPND. Mwe bantu ba kwalesa. Ilia embassy paki na ya luka private party ya ba haka inde. Njebe ni. Because as far as I'm concerned, a symmetry, no one owns the, no, one's, no one owns a symmetry. No tapabo wa kwata ownership pamanda. Umuntu uli wose kuti haya pamanda kamonga ni private grave. Let's say pamanda pamwandi umuntu nga na musanga pamanda padiba mayolo padiba tata. Kuti na muipusha. But then I can't stop them because I don't know wonsi ya wantu wa ishiwe ba mayona ba tata. Now that embassy pack pa pa washi kama presidents. So umuntu kuti akwata maka aya kukanya abantu kuya bika marets pamanda honestly. Okay, this is too much. It's again a violation upon violation. Violation upon violation. Takwab. That's why to anafati my inspector general wachi tete resign because takwa wachi ta oni manda. I'm a president, they are their national leaders, they are statesmen. Anyone can go and lay a wreath. And you cannot force someone to, to attend to come when you invite them. We are not babies. No. We are not babies. Why you PND? Mwangfa. Tapari baby. 
you should be spoon feeding us you should be telling us where to go and where not to go no it doesn't work like that it does not work like that it's too much hmm? Mairo, tu abuki na kuliwa kapoko la kunkunan, kuchukua church kuliwa ba kenyi ba bishop ali kupuingira, yako tu abuki na mairo. Iliana yoni ni human rights violation ni kalamba, because even even when there was World War One and World War Two, kavale angali la kuma church, aba biyengo ndwe shi kalamba mchealo, kuma World War One, World War Two, abena Hitler, kavale angere kuma church, the churches were left alone. If you go to Europe today, there were churches which were built in the 1500s. They are still standing because when the war was happening in Europe, nobody went to the church. They respect the churches and religion. Nobody went there. Who Europe? Well, quite the World War One and World War Two. It was declared a war around to Valerwa. No, Mamuza, me na tu kwata pwenkondo. Katukwe tenkondo, but mwai mamu atuma waka pokola pa church. What is that? It's very disrespectful and insulting. And it's a violation of human rights. Ndee niyewa imina nguwe shosho wale panga, shika yoku tali. Shire yoku tali, tafia apuili hapa pene, tafia apuili hapa pene, because they are doing big things. If intefo wale chita, wale chita kwa chikuwa angala, but if intefo wale chita, the things they are doing have got big implications. Milan. Peace is always something. Always something. You know, Pamanda. Pamanda. Shua pala la baka undo. Pamu inga ya mkutantika. Finani kani. Fima amad vehicles. Nenso ni ta mkwete. You are even backing up those vehicles on the graves of people who are resting. How do you think those people are arresting? Do you think our leaders are resting in peace? When you go and line up amad vehicles on their graves, it is a shame. It is a shame, you know. You should consult. Some of these things, you need to consult before you do some of these things. It is not right. It is disrespecting to the memory of all our fallen heroes. Ukuya mkutanti ke fima mnyoto ka fiam kondo. Pampa manda shabu. A graveside is, is, is like a whatever. I don't even know what to word to use. Muchi sungu. Pampa manda ya maste. Pari chindi kwa. Hmm? Tepa kusalula salula mwa mkula tanti ka waka pokola. Ne fima mnyoto ka kwa chipari nkondo. Eh? Because I'm the fire in none can by Edgar Lungu by Epo. It is shameful. It is shameful. The whole world is watching. The whole world is watching. Nangwa yupi, nangwa PF of Bale Michita. But PF by the Tantka Pofi Nan can. Fima Mad Vehicles, Varia Tantka Papa Manda. A resting place is a holy place, is revered. You know, you can't go to the parade of Akapokola. Pamanda, I am a statement. Our former presidents, Kosalulavan, who is disrespecting the memory and the legacy of our presidents. Eh? Mukala tu ya tuari temo kula ndalanda tu akula ndalanda tu tu akaleke. It's not fair. It's not fair that uh, you know a whole government can go go and parade armored vehicles at at a at a barrier site of of our our fallen heroes, our great statesmen. It's an insult. Ngani Edgar Lungu Mulefa, kamu sendeni, 
Now, in your quest, in your obsession, these people, they are obsessed with the Edgar Chagwalungu. Hmm? In or your obsession with the Edgar Chagwalungu, mwamba na kula chite ni pamba numba. Mi pamba eh? Ukuya tanzika fima 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 miyoto kati yangu ndo pama pamanda yama 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 foleni freedom fighters vacha just because you don't want lungu to go there ni zambia yenu ah weba msamba tefio vachita na bobe ni avale ni pera my instructions kuwe kari kapansi mwaba funda some people you need to educate them that's why you are there, Bam Samba. You are professionals. Muzambia police. Pokuwa wa chakuku itiach Inspector General of Zambia Police. That is a highly a high post. Iya kwa tu freewa yaku training. Fionse fintu wa Zambia. Psychology, sociology, philosophy. Fionse mufire mwa Zambia. Mwani fishi ba imaz Inspector of of Police. Inspector General. Awa me never let me pen my instructions. Kuwa take a punch. Mwa beba tawe fitafia mwone ke mwino tuwala tule chite ni pamba. Te tutuwale mwino toka shankondo. Pa, pa, pa manda, pa man, pa barrio site. I am great statesman of Zambia. Obu maya mkuta ntika fi mwino toka na waka pokola. Na mwisusha fulu fulu because of Edgar Chagwalungu. Oh what a shame. Shame on you. Shame on you. I don't even know how you speak at night. How you sleep at night. Kashinga mulala shan. Kakuni nete international community. International community nangubare tamba. Vene fintu file vende rabu ino mchalo. Problem is Zambia there. They don't care about international community. Iba disayi nama deals wale imba mawe wale senda. Eh? Bale seka kofi atimone ni nombo kubale miseka. Tapadi ukalanda. International community tapadi ukalanda. Mwari mwonefe bachitile. Ela bachitile mpawa. Wari ya tandala. Konse. Konse chalo. Wari endere chalo chonse. Wari tandala. Wari tandala. Eh? International community yomule landa. Wakula tamba kufi wale seka. Timone ni dero. Batu wale nyoto kufi manda. Fi nankan. Ifi ma uo viekos. Fi di pa fa pa manda. They won't say anything. Wakula ya ba imba mawe ba senda. But the ama problems will continue, you know. We have to keep talking. Bena Zambia akulandeni and mulechikana. Tuafika na ifi ii dictatorship ya wa msamba. Ifa tuishi wa msamba kabi lewa lepe la maodazi. So ime wa msamba, ni wa fisho mwale aba chilanda ti wa msamba should step down. Yes, he should step down. Bam Samba should step down. Actually, we should move and move an emotion to impeach him. How can he send if he fifty nine? Katwishinga wa fita tishani if he miyoto kafiyanko ndo pamanda to the graves of our beloved, highly respected statesman. Opo ba yamkutanika ba kapokola. Pakuti hongwe yapo. It is a shame. Now, the other thing is when there was actual World War One and World War Two, the churches were left alone. So how dare this UPND government? They can send the back to the church. Eh? UPND government here is more brutal than Hitler because Hitler had the Indian church. Try the poor people in the church. All the churches in Europe, they were built long time ago, but they were not touched. Tava ponesha pa bomu nanguimo. Kuma church, cause they respect religion. I am wondering, Elia Shiryo. I'll read your comments and go now. Like TikTok, I want to focus the chat. It's it's very very. I don't know, man. You can travel with Ngananda. I don't know what you can say. Like this thing of sending Bahapokola Kukukuma gravesite because Valere Shabalungu. 
so no mbatu wa kuna poka permission kuli wa kuli 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 wa kuli wa haka inde na wa wa musamba as zambians no you are violating uh, zambians freedom zambia is a democracy we are free to move we are free to affiliate we are free to go anywhere Ero na yama permit kuhu kuhu mishitake informba polisa tuleyo ku you send manpower for security you don't send manpower to stop people accessing a public grave site that is unheard of it is unheard of to send a, 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 a poli the entire police to stop citizens from going to a uh, to a, a memorial park a burial ground a graveyard who does that like really who does that how do you sleep at night Bam samba imwe. How can you send police officer kumanda at Musumi Nishawan to SM Kubika Nankan? Bebe bebe babaka la bela ma respect siabo. How do you sleep at night? Really, it's a shame. It is a shame. And we'll be here, we'll be talking. And you need to resign. Ngana mufirwa, if you are being pressured to do things which are unconstitutional, you just step down. That's what you do. Because there was a the day of reckoning is coming. The day of reckoning is coming. This thing of sending the Hapokola Pamanda who graveside to be to prevent people from paying the, the their respects is a maximum violation. Where dead people are supposed to be resting in peace. How do you, are those people resting in peace really? Do you think the spirits of our ancestors, of our statesmen, will rest in peace? Do you think you are going to rule this country peacefully when you are upsetting the buried people? They are resting in peace. A graveyard is supposed to be a peaceful place. Respect, you know. But who grave their dead? Oh, number one, for who that was a drama. So number, what if PF defied the order? And that's why you will call. Would you could have been a good grave side? Respect our statesmen. Like pick and choose your battles. You don't take your squabbles to a memorial park where our our founders of a great nation are lying your petty fights you take them there using the zambia police that's why Bamsamba should resign you don't do that it's an insult to the republic of zambia it's the biggest insult i think i can say here comfortably like sending the police officers to the grave site of our fallen freedom fighters, including well, the place of Ashikawa Kaunda, that is the biggest insult to the Zambians. Because nobody has a right to stop anyone from going to put a wreath. Just because we So if So look By UPND, look a person to order. If these people had any shame, they can even come out and apologize for doing what they did. Yeah. I think I'm done, guys. Well, I'm going to go to TikTok and could you try to join in a uh, discussion. But it's just upsetting, you know? It's just one thing after the other. Yeah. One thing after the other. What happened in Nakuma Church? Takwa what happened in Nakuma Church? Now we hear that what you mean, Drama World War One, Drama World War Two. Hitler stayed away from the churches. We woke up yesterday. But police were in the church. We went. Lelo, but Chaba Tuara de Rokumanda. Like, what do you want? Ten chef from Lefoya. What do you UPND? Nama Musamba. What do you really want from Zambians? Because you are doing the unheard of. You know. Because Zambia is not at war. Zambia, the party in condom Zambia. Zambia is not at war. But even when we know that when there was World War One or World War Two, they stayed away from churches because they respect religion. But Muzamba Tamuri in condo, we woke up yesterday. What is that? 
lelo mwana kumanda kunshishi a graveside is a sacred place oko mule twala madrama yenu au mwandini twanaka na imwe you know just deliver your promises and stop obsessing with Edgar Chagwalungu. After you have failed to deliver your promises, Mwambo kita obsessed by Edgar Edgalungu. Instead, you just ask by Edgar Edgalungu how he ruled the country. Maybe you come assembly la kwa manu. You fix the country and solve of the problems ya mazamienzi. Eyo balepitamu. Instead of this obsession number, ya mituwa na mkuchita break the law because of your obsession. It is a shame. Alright, that's all for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you, peace. I gotta go.